Like I think really anything can make me feel beautiful. I don't feel like I have to put on makeup every day. I just like how I look. So I guess just having my face makes me feel beautiful. But on the flip side of that, I love makeup, love beauty products, love using them. So sometimes I love to get all like glammed up, put 87 layers of makeup on my face. And that also makes me feel beautiful. Just everything you sat down, I'm then gonna put on. So I actually used to make clothing and I was in a bad car accident in 2010 and I broke my right hand. And I generally always struggle with anxiety and depression, but like that was really horrible because I was like, oh, surprise, you can't really like do that as great anymore. And I was like, well, this is awful. And I had a friend who knew that I loved makeup and computers. And so he showed me somebody's video online and was like, hey, look at this tutorial. Like, you know, you could totally do this. And so I just went home that day and my very first video was a review on fake fingernails. Hey, hi, hello. Hey everybody, it's Bunny. <laughs> Who is ready to follow me around? Here's Johnny. I feel like when I started YouTube and people were like, ah, oh, what do you do? And I was like, oh, I make YouTube videos. And people were like, you do what? And I was like, it's a thing on the internet. Don't worry about that. But now it's like social media has exploded in the last five years. So now it's like, I feel like there's a lot of pressure and people start out channels just hoping that they're gonna like be super famous. But to me, that's not what it's about. It's like, I wanna make content that I would want to enjoy, that I would wanna watch, instead of like just feeling the need to like make content that I think is gonna be popular. I never really am a person to like have a backup plan. I just feel like you just live. I feel like if you give yourself a backup plan, that's like a way to fail. Cause you're like, ah, like if I'm not good at this, I'll just pick up 10 cans on the side of the road. <laughs> Lately though, I do think that teaching sounds like fun. Like, especially if I got to teach, like where you get to like make the boards, where you get to like, you get like cutouts of bees. You write all the names on the bees. I mean, that just seems like, Pure fun. I gotta give you one more hug. I love your videos. Thank you I hope so you much. keep up with it. Yeah, and you're you. a really big inspiration. Honestly, from day one, I just loved it so much, and immediately there was that sense of community. And I mean, now it's grown so much. You know, now it's a swamp family. Hey, Claire and Mika, thank you guys so much for being swamp family members. Next time I come here, I'm gonna leave a special surprise for y'all. Okay, bye. So I love the show Swamp People, and I was like. We need a name. You guys are like family. It's called the Swamp Family. I just, I was never one of those people where I was like, I'm gonna call you the Bunnovators or the Bun Tatoes. I don't have like a rhyming name, you know? Like, what rhymes with bunny? Oh, besides funny. That's me. <laughs>